When it comes to sensors, vision is definitely has to be the basis of things, right? I think that, that there's no question roads and life is designed for that. The way that Tesla does this, and this is from back in 2022, the last time they had a big sort of open meeting, they discussed in great detail how they essentially use Unreal Engine, at least at the time. They would take in this data from human drivers. What they could do is they could take that data, they could pull it in and then reproduce a million variants of that inside the Unreal Engine. And the Unreal Engine was was good enough that it could fake looking exactly like real video. So it's almost like backwards. They would take the real video out of the car, they would put it inside the game engine and reduce it to the quality of real video again. And so the car had effectively raw input that it thought was real input, but was fake, but they could produce all of these variations of any kind of weird edge case or anything. That is really, really hard for, you know, for artificial neural networks to do, but they're getting to that point now. And, and Tesla's not the only one. Figure has been working on this as well, learning from video. And if they can get that sort of coordinate transformation learning from video to work well, then the entire internet opens up to them. And there's only so much scaling you can do. Whereas if you can learn from actual video, yeah, then we're talking, then things get out of control.